everyone who else is like sitting at home moaning and groaning, they, uh -huh. they're going to rot. It's, it's so, true. It's true. It's a good time for everyone to sort of, um, you know, get, get things going and moving. I agree. I'm excited yeah. for everything. And I'm so glad that building work is still able to go on because I was really concerned about that. Me too. Jesus. And actually, um, I heard some, some building company, they're having trouble like, to source materials. But fortunately, Bond is quite connected. <laughs> and no yeah, we just steal them. We just steal the materials. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, I'm excited to meet him. Yeah, they all. They, 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 lots of lots of building supplies are open for business. Mm -hmm. um, That's great. But we've got to spread out all over London to go and bucket them yeah. and get them. So there's more. There's more traveling. They don't really like delivering because. Um, there, there's not enough delivery drivers uh, but you know we, we've got you know obviously for you the only problem will be the kitchen later on so hopefully by then in two three months time yeah. we'll be back to normal mm. anyway yeah let's hope <laughs> yeah so you know windows all the other stuff we can go yeah. and get off the, sh but, off the uh, shelf the thing that we will have planning approval in six weeks hopefully Okay. It will yeah. take a little bit longer depending on the county. Mm -hmm. And then after that, we can start the works on for the extension. So I think we will be okay like for lead time for the kitchen. Yeah, that would be great. I'm excited. So I'm going to show, uh, I've talked yesterday with the, the builders on site. And I, as I mentioned in my email this morning, they need the structural drawings and calculation for the chimney now. Otherwise, they can remove it. So I think we need to like, move forward with all the rest of uh, the structural engineer. And I talk to our um, structural engineer. We work with him with basically every project. And he said that there is no problem. So if there is any change or any amendment that needs to be done after planning approval, we will do that anyway. Okay. So if you're happy, I'm going to like instruct both of them so they can go for a site visit and do they drawing and calculation yeah? okay sounds good okay perfect so let me share the screen which is this one okay uh first thing which is a small it's a small thing is related to one set okay uh, this is the first floor and in order to have our, um, um, like the joinery below the window, I moved yeah. the radiator in this wall. Okay. And so I just wanted like, to make sure that you know, you knew that we moved the um, radiator here. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I think I saw it. I, I looked at this drawing. I think yes. I saw it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we go back. Yeah, uh, are you um, for the skylight? They are really big, but you can decide to have those smaller. I just wanted to put like a big size for for um, planning approval, and then you can decide like to have any size. Yeah, yeah that, I like that, that big skylight at the back. That is mm. that is a large piece of glass. So it's mm -hmm. good to have one here because the means yeah. here because yeah, yeah. The, the kitchen has no natural light yeah okay and yeah that's why we had one year and one a, a smaller a smaller one on the rear that actually yeah, yeah i just put that there because yeah something we can discuss uh, you can have any size like. i don't need that yeah okay so um uh, we have done some preliminary images. Then now, after your comments, we will do like, uh, Ricardo actually will do the final 3D views. <laughs> so, <Yeah>. um, <laughs> here we have two light like, cabinets. So you will have like mm -hmm. all the fridge. And I think that for storage, you want, you want to have some hanging unit as well below yes. uh, above. And for seeing yeah, kind of, we, we use some like shelves here. There can be any material. I mean, we just use some like lighter wood because it's 
it was like too dark and it would be nice yeah. something like to match the island but mm, again like this is something that when we approach the the kitchen company that we they will show us some samples or finishes and we can decide like you you can decide which one you like but the idea okay. to have like something like dark here and something light on the island mm. so, and do you prefer sorry to interrupt you yeah. i'm so torn between black or all white because does all white make it feel like it's bigger or uh, because i like how the black looks but i'm like from your personal experience do you feel like it would look more open because remember the as you said the kitchen yeah. doesn't have that much light so that's why i'm like it's so what uh, I we can do the color we can do another one all white all the cabinets white right? Uh, so we do, we do let me one, let me let me looking for. If you can do like while we talk, so then I will show it to her. And so um, it's really we're going to have a look in three D and see how it looks like. If it's not yeah. white, it can be maybe like just wood, but not a black wood, but like a kind of this, because all white. Nah, I don't want that. Nah, I, I got, want it to be, it's, it's what I feel like it's just right. one way over. I don't really like it when it's wood. Wood to me is like not as like clean. And yeah, chic. I understand. Okay, so it's white. a pen. We try white. Yeah, because it's a white unit. But yeah, because my important like um, now is to decide exactly the location, and I think that we we need to have a the fridge in this corner, and the oven yeah 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 to here, and all the rest will affect yeah. the lighting and uh, um, the the small the small power and all the things. So, this, mm, Susanna, uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, we ha we have another version of this kitchen with the cabinets um, totally white, but in the old folder. Uh, the old uh, one. 18, yes. Yeah. Yes. Let me have a. Ah, uh, yes, we have one. Yeah. Yeah. Which actually yeah, there is another sofa. Yeah, it's not. Yes, I, it's we know one. that is no it's not good, but the, yeah, the kitchen is totally white. Well, you actually look. Mm, I don't know, but I think it probably looks La yeah, it looks a more as if, as if. My advice is that the space is very, very big. So, the is, yeah, the I don't think that the color of the kitchen is a problem for mm -hmm. this space, okay. but just for this space because you're, yeah. you're, oh, you think it's, it's correct. Yeah, yeah, but Ooh. I'm just thinking that we don't have enough light here. So, actually, white doesn't look bad. Mm. I quite like white. I quite like, like the, with the yeah. um, I do like the white. I do. But so then the contrast in work surface maybe yes, not like yeah. the <laughs> That's the thing. I do like the white because I feel like it just it even though you're right that the room is very big, yeah. so it's not that it feels yeah. small, but I like the fact that the white like bounces off. Even though okay, this is a 3D drawing, so it's like I know, yeah. I know, I know, I know what you're <laughs> Yeah, but I do. I did like the. Black. I don't know. It's a thing. So um, decision. But I do quite like white. I do quite like. White. I actually I wasn't like sure white. at the beginning, but now that now that I look all white, I think it looks. It looks better. It does look. <laughs> yeah, it looks really nice, doesn't it? Yeah. It does like look very really white. Ugly. Yeah. Okay. And then, and so, sorry. And then yeah. my next question then would be. Then the fireplace wall should be white then as well. Uh, let's go to the fireplace. So we have done a couple of options, which are... Yeah, because oh, you already know, you see me dropping my pins on Pinterest. I'm like, mm, yes. there's so many different ways that you can work with this space, that you can make it both practical and look good. So it's very... So I'm kind of like... One was, we have like a storage here, mm. and all storage below. And let's see if I can... Yeah, because I prefer the TV when it's more towards the garden because it's more in oh, the front okay. of the living room. Uh, Ricardo, can you do a view? Yeah. Uh, it's not very easy like to see that. Like this yeah. one with the TV, but like from this point, so we can look at the whole wall. Yeah. 
because it's not easy like to see the whole world. Yeah, directly from Revit. Uh, yes, any 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 image. So um, I agree with the TV towards the garden because if you look at this, it's not nice like to have like blocking the view. Yeah. So I totally, yeah, I totally exactly. agree like to have the TV here. We have just done a couple of options. It's this one, but I can't. It's not. I'm now Ricardo. Oh yeah, you can't view. So got no, it. So view from the kitchen, so we can actually see how it looks with the window, which is basically this one. Mm -hmm. But I don't good. like the black, I think. Yeah, do you know what I mean? It's too big, it's too overpowering, I think. Yeah, okay. For the space. Okay, so let me see. Chimney wall. Um, so the TV toward the, wind, the garden. And we try like with white... Um, Chimney and storage. Okay. Fireplace, sorry, storage. Uh, this is our. It looks good though. Four panels. Maybe we can have three panels. What? Do, because what what's the do? difference between? Okay, not what's the difference. Obviously, I know the difference. But so if it's three panels, it's just wider. But what's this? What's sight line? Because I know that there's different sight lines for bifold doors, right? Is that a thing? Am I saying it right? Like the thickness or something. Yeah, um, you, can, you can get slim, you can get very, very slim frame bifolds. Which the slimmer the frame, the more money they are. <laughs> so, um, you know, you can do three panels uh, with really slim line uh, frames, uh, which would be really nice. Um, or, mm. you know, um, did we have a discussion about doing a fixed sliding door last time? Yeah, nah, because here's my thing. A, where is it sliding to? Like, do you know what I mean? Because yeah. I yeah. really do want the window seat. There's nowhere for it to go. That's yeah. the only reason um, why, like, bifold work for me, because I knew, I knew for a fact that I wouldn't be, it's not going to have the same effects as you see on, like, a Pinterest house where it's, like, the whole yeah. width of the house. Yeah. But the yeah. thing is, for me, I just feel like I'd rather have the, the window seat as an area, as part of the living room. I feel like it yeah. creates more of, like, a living room space and being realistic um and probably with bifolds you can really only open them up the whole way during summer at least with the window seat i can use it all year round i guess yeah. you know i'm just yeah. trying to like, think um, thinking about a bifold or what I, i've done for the floor which is another thing we need to discuss is like mm. to have um the same floor that we have in the kitchen and in the dining room going outside so when you open these, it's like a big space with the same material. Because wait, can you, is the floor different to the floor that I can see in front of the, in the living room? Uh, the two floors, is it one floor? Yes, yeah, so there's some, there's, I'm not sure if you like this. Oh yeah, I can see it now, okay. Because that was another thing I was going to ask you mm -hmm. about, is the flooring, because I don't, I don't really understand whether, for example, the wood flooring obviously can't go in the kitchen. You need to have a particular type of flooring for the kitchen, right? I, I use a large format uh, tile. Mm -hmm. But then I don't want that tile to then be where the dining room table is. I only oh, want it in the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> just, just the, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, let me take some notes. Um... Because I think it will look weird, well, it's like going to, it's going to be, just to make sure, it's going to be like the same mm -hmm. material here and all here and all this area, and tiles just in the kitchen. Yeah, that's how I visualize it more because I feel like it create, creates more of a continuity, and then the same flooring that's throughout the house I'll put in the office room, which is in the front room. Okay, perfect. The downstairs to be one for the kitchen, and then the upstairs to be. I just wanted to do make just grey carpet, like a really nice grey carpet for upstairs. I think mm -hmm. nice and clean. Upstairs, upstairs is going to be carpet everywhere. Yeah, like and yeah, what, I, I think so. what about the staircase? So it's another thing we want. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, because I, originally I wanted to. Yeah, do, um, I've done something like that. 
Yeah, because originally I was going to just do the carpet on the stairs, but mm-hmm. now I'm not sure because I, I hadn't actually thought of that. I just, in my head, just assumed, okay, just do the same thing throughout just because, mm-hmm. I don't know, that's just how all my, like, since I was a child, that's always how the houses have been. Like, downstairs is wood, upstairs is carpet. But I do <laughs> want to, um, you know what I mean? It's just, like, classic, but I don't know. I need to think about that. But at the moment, I was just thinking the grey carpet that would be upstairs because I thought I thought it would look really nice against the, you know, how I wanted the glass with the, the silver handrail? Because mm-hmm. I sent it to you, Nick, didn't I? Yeah. Um, yeah, Kylie Jenner's staircase, because that is beautiful. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, so I, I thought that the grey would look nice with the silver handrail. That's why the vibe I was kind of direction. Do you have a, re- a reference of, uh, of Um, I do, I do, I do. But um, if you go on Instagram, I'll, the easiest way yeah. is if you go on Kylie Jenner's and go to, hold on. If you just scroll down, you're going to see a picture that she's taken on the fourth row down to the right fourth to the right and you'll see she's taking a mirror picture and you can see her stairs in the background of that picture you know next to the picture of her and kendall okay (laughs) see that's those stairs are really nice and those stairs they don't have carpet so that's why i'm open to it not being carpet but it's also like i just want it to look I just want it to go really well with the silver accents of the staircase. So I'm open to it not being carpet, but I, I just yeah. feel like I want it to look very modern. And she's got, very, she's got, I think from what she's got, she's got like a gray, gray wood stairs. But I'm open to whatever. But just not, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's, I just like that particular style because I like the fact that you can see the side of the staircase. Yeah, and that, this is a, what she's done there is a lot easier. To do as well. What who Kylie? Yeah, the, what what the, the one they, she's doing there? That one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the yeah, thing. yeah. yeah. That's a lot easier Let me to see do. One what. second. Let me see. Oh, how how do I? Can I not? Oh, um, I do want to put this bigger. I'll WhatsApp it to you. Okay, great. Yeah, go on, go on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so stay. It looks good though. It is very good. I'm loving it so far. <laughs> Uh, it's actually really important to visualize the space. It is. It really is. Ah, I is can't... It is definitely easier. Yes, it is. Easier. A lot easier. Yeah, a lot mm. easier than what I've done. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Yes, because... It, this yeah, is, no, that's this is more best like focus. It's, it's easier. Yeah. I got yeah. it. Yeah, let's I, keep it... Oh, is everybody frozen? Or is, it just me that, is everyone frozen? No, I'm fine. We're here. Oh, yeah, okay, you're fine. You're fine. Everyone's back. Sorry, carry on. The thing is that um, in this case, we have the stringer, which yeah. is the one. So it's not going, you, you're not going to see like the, um, the steps, but just yeah, yeah, yeah. the line. And but I'm going to see how we can use that reference here and send you then more, more images. Yeah. Okay. Because Thank you. Uh, Thank you so much. It's fine. That's all right. So I understand now the look that you want. And all year it would be storage. That is, well, yeah. it's like storage. And I'm showing these as well in the plans, which is this part. And yeah. let me see my list was about mm. okay, kitchen layout, this book joinery. Okay, we now we I think we can go floor finishes discuss. We can go upstairs now. So let's see more. This one, two, three, four. Yes, so this one, I mm-hmm. think that um, I'm not sure if you want to go ahead with a, like a kind of storage. Probably doesn't look how, like that nice as is in the plan. And that's why uh, I've tried in 3D 
but I wanted to uh, propose something different, which is something like... Yeah, you know me, I'm, I'm always open. I'm open to things, different things, because I some things... I wanted to adapt work. this with like full height mirrors, just on the wall without... Yeah, that's also nice. Boundary. Okay. And as it, this looks a bit claustrophobic. You'll yeah, be in your bed. Um, there. That's, this is that's no good. The thing is that you have a big, uh, you have already a big working wardrobe. So having like this 400, 350. Yeah, you probably won't need it. I, I would have the more sort yeah. of detailed, um, you know, panel, like fake panelling on the walls or so lovely we lights. Maybe here. some panelling. Yeah. 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 But then, my, my main thing is for the room to feel like a hotel room. So therefore. Okay. Exactly. Yeah. So I probably you know, wouldn't put any joinery on that side of the wall. I would probably just have nice detailing. Um, yeah, I was thinking like fabrics. something like that, maybe as well. Yeah, because you see, that's more my direction. That's why at yeah. first, I remember at first, I didn't say I wanted it to be storage. Before I was just like, I just wanted yeah. to feature yeah. wall. I would so have more like a like padded, that. you know, a full height padded wall like this with lovely low lying, um, okay. you know, storage and lighting. Perfect. Yeah, because my main thing, I definitely want to have a lighting element to that wall. Um, I love, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the, wherever it goes, whether it be like, because I like this picture that you're showing me. I like, I like if we had like a little strip of, you know, little. Because mm -hmm. for me, I love it when I'm in my room and I can just have like very low lighting. I, I love it when I can just have not the main lights on. I, I like to have a, a low light in my room, you know. So yeah, as you can see, that's the thing. I'm very open. Because you can visualize something in your head and it just doesn't translate, you know. Yeah. Okay, but now I think so. It's better if we just uh, work on the wall without any storage, without adding any storage. Exactly, and then we can come back to that because most crucial thing we're on the site now building, uh, mm -hmm. so we need we yes. next week or the week after we're going to be doing the ceiling, the coffered lighting. Yeah. So. Um, yeah, but send me a quote for that, Nick. Yeah, we'll do. Yeah, we're doing it. So we're waiting for Susanna. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've, 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 sent, I've sent already the drawings to Bond, but now oh, right, good. obviously good. Uh, now at the moment, yeah. at the moment that I done something like that, which was dictated from the position of this, but if we don't, if we don't have any storage here. We can have yeah. I get what you're saying. It goes back a little bit. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. So we will have this obviously bigger or centered. Got you. Yeah, so and then So then the main storage, but then I still feel like mm, but I guess I guess the wall where the TV is will have storage and I guess I just exactly. need to focus on the so either sure side of the bed you have your freestanding lovely units which you can buy from a third party. And then on mm -hmm. this wall you have your your uh, a nice bit of joinery. Yeah, this is really nice. I love this. Mm. With, so you have like this it's not just a, a desk but you can have yeah 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 oh yeah 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 That's great. and then a low unit here yeah i think that looks lovely i love that That's and basically lovely. the coffer ceiling it would be um do um nick do you have any image any images of coffer ceiling that we have done in previous project um yeah hold on a sec and but this this is like very very like easy um, unit. What it would be more uh, like this, but it would be this wall. But I'm going to like do some different option and send to you like some three D use. You can see mm -hmm. what it looks like with the, a lighting uh, like a pendant or and all all these will affect obviously the position of the lighting as well. Yeah, of course, of course. No. But yeah, I don't need the storage though. You're mm -hmm. right. I'm fine with that. I'd rather just focus on the... Um, I just want it to feel really nice mm -hmm. and look really nice. And at least we have the storage on the other side and then I have the storage in the walk-in wardrobe. So Yeah, correct. Um, yes, bathroom. This is another thing I wanted to talk to discuss. So mm -hmm. 
Um, we never talk actually about bath bathroom, so I'm not. I don't know what you like and what you don't like. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. All right. So I have a very clear vision of the bathroom. Oh, okay. Yeah. Where's the, that thing? Where you're not that one. The one next to it. No. To the to left. To left. Yeah. That that type of marble tile. That's this is c the closest to how I would like the bathroom to be okay. in the sense that how I visualize it, the walls will have floor to ceiling marble tiles okay the bathroom the the wall next to the bathtub i think i think i would like to have that wall to be one mirror you know because i think i really like when a bathroom has a big mirror you know um the wall next to the bathroom next to the bathtub uh let me go to the plan one second the wall this wall no, no no the one to the to scroll over no 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 to left to left sorry here yeah yeah yeah. that wall yeah 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 that to be how i visualize it being a big mirror but then it's also like yeah to see how it look like. okay yeah just to see how it looks yeah but i like the idea of putting a mirror there okay. um and then uh, i'm going to show you in 3d what i've done here is to create some uh, as like it's a big space we can probably have some like shelves that they can be yeah i love that i love that they can be something like this yes i mean don't obviously look at the shower but they will be cladded with the same material yeah 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 exactly so yeah i love that that okay. was great perfect and the unit, the um, wash basin unit, it will be a uh, freestanding or you want, let me see, the one we were looking at before was bathroom. It's like, it's obviously, it's not, a bespoke is a unit that we can like buy and is not going to be cladded with the same material yeah 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 that's more my direction yeah that's fine but I, and i don't really mind what color as well because not that i don't mind but i i like bathrooms with black detailing but i also like i don't mind when they just have when it's just i don't know i'm still deciding if i want to have but i feel like an all white bathroom is really nice it doesn't have to have the black even, detail even uh, on the floor yeah, I want. I just want the whole thing just to the be same. even the floor. Okay. Yeah, the everything the same. I, even on the floor, it's going to be the same. Okay, I think so. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's right. I know I have. Uh, yes, I was thinking of uh, having a mirror, not the full like. Sorry, not the old wall. To be yeah, but that's nice as well. Like yeah, something. but that's nice as well. Okay. Right. Yeah, it's just a mirror, a mirrored element. I don't know why. I just love mirrored walls because I feel like it just opens up the space so much. Not because I like, like looking at myself, <laughs> no, but I just feel like it just opens up the space so much. Yeah, it, it, it actually good. Yeah, okay. in New York, I live in um, I have a studio apartment, and my studio is so small, but it, it's so nice because it feels airy and bright, and that's the feeling yeah. that I want to have. So Ricardo, it just sent me this let me see how i can show it's not rendered but i think the one second or load um. how many computer screens do you have two she's like a genie didn't she <laughs> i have two i have two two, two screens so oh um, yes yes something that obviously is just at the moment it's not a uh, Render. Yeah, no, but I understand. I understand. Yeah. So maybe then this one can be. I was thinking yep. this one to be. So, sorry, Susie. Yes. Just have a look at my screen. Because um, it's better. My screen. We can see. Maybe send me. Send me an eye opening. Okay. 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 Just a moment um, because I have finished now the render. So. Okay. Great. Thanks. I was thinking Thank of using this on having like this part not that big but 
Some yeah, it doesn't have to be that big because yeah. now, because I like that shape, that the shape, but it's also like it doesn't need to be so as big because I feel then yeah. it makes the room feel smaller because then it's almost like bringing uh -huh. the wall. So we we worry a little bit with that. With it looks quite deep. I don't think it needs to be so uh, deep. Actually, so I have a, I have actually a reference on Pinterest, which works really well. On uh, bedroom, no. Is chimney wall. So we can create like the opposite of this one. Instead of, of, of being deep, it can just be less deep. There would be yeah, I like that from the um, size of the fireplace, which is something that we I'm um, probably start to have a look at and put send you some specification as well. Um, yeah, because yeah. the fireplace is I have really a look at the folder. Well, okay, you save that, so... It's not finished, but I think it's better. Okay, yeah. That's what that... Mm. Yeah, white is definitely better. Yeah. yeah. But we need, we are, we're going to work a little bit with this. Maybe we have this deeper as a storage. And um, now, now, that, now that we talk to you, we can like work more on these three views and send you like final ones or more options for you like to decide what you like. Yeah, I like that. I'm going, I like to, this I'm going to send you all of those at the moment. And yes. in, in a, in, by end of, of the week, we will have the updated ones. That sounds really good, but it looks really, really good. Okay, that's mm -hmm. all right. Uh, Fine, do you have any other questions? So obviously we're on site now and we're gonna be moving really quickly. Um, so we need to get the detail sorted. I just need oh. to, for us to price <laughs> the, the co coffered ceiling. I just need to know what kind of coffered ceiling we're gonna go for. We're gonna go for uh, the one I've just sent you where it's the perimeter oh. and, it's, and it's raised in the middle or we're gonna have it drops and the LED around the outside hidden. So we need to know where the lighting's gonna be um Wait, did you send it to me no i, to I, me. I, I just literally oh. i said i sent it to you now it's something we've did in um in chelsea uh a few years ago it's, it's a, a a lounge dining area i think i've i've seen it i've seen it the tilt yeah, it's in tight chelsea. street in chelsea yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah trust me yeah oh yeah i know i know i've been uh examining yeah. your work Stalking, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what's this one considered sorry so I explain this one. this is a so we have the perimeter which is lower. So that it means that in the plan, uh, sorry, let me go back to the other one. See. So the lower part would be all the perimeter. Got you. And or you can do it, you can do it the other way where the, the, the middle the part way. of the ceiling is lower. And, and, that, and yeah, the, like, the like over the bed. That could be a better look for your, this one because that, that house there is very it's, uh, like a traditional kind of terraced house. Yours is going to be very modern contemporary. So we do it the other way around with the middle bit lower and uh -huh. the outside higher. Oh, I get what you're saying now. But you have, okay, you have like saying. all the light going in. Like. Yeah, so the, the, the light is, is hidden those right here. Walls, this wall and this wall, which actually that's what I had in my in my mind because we need like light on this wall and we need light on this wall. But yeah, yeah, yeah I think I just need to see it and also the quote. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna, we're get, I, I've got Bond coming in. He's on the way in, so I'll speak to him now. And um, we're trying to get some keys cut for you as well because obviously oh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. very hard to get keys cut. And if I can I get know. some keys cut today, um, I'll meet up of you some at some point today. And give you the yeah. key and also give you the high vis so if you, want, if you want to get in there and do some images you've got all that so you can you know no one will complain about you being in the building site with no protection on the stairs Suzanne are we gonna have any lighting on the stairs going up the stairs as well so we have a lighting here on the landing 
Yeah, but you know, on the treads of the stairs going up, like a, a, a like a, a modern look with the, on the treads, LED lights going up the stairs. Um, have, you, have you considered that, Leona, as well? Yeah, well, um, you know what my stair budget is, so uh, yeah. if it fits in I that mean, budget, I mean, then I, you let I me know. Yeah. It's not like a very big staircase. So. Yeah, it's not that big. That's the thing. So, so, that's why I didn't really think about it because I was kind of just like. Any, any LED. It's just quite nice in the evening when it's dark. You have the little LED little lights on the on the on the wall tread going up. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Well, if it fits in the budget, then right. slide them in there. Right. We're, we're, we're have a look. They're not, they're literally and they're not expensive anyway. It's not. It's just we need to know sooner rather than later because I know because it needs to be wired in. Like, yeah. it work like to put yeah. the light in. And I wanted to ask you guys as well. Um, what are your thoughts or what do you guys know about smart lighting? Not that I necessarily want it, but my friend was talking about it the other day and I just wanted to know a little bit more information. Like, is it worth it? Is it not? Because I, not, I don't personally care if I have it or not, but I would just like to know what your thoughts are on it and what the process is and how much is that? But if you, if, it, I, if you have it all through um, Hive, which is the new one, which each, each individual light is all wired up to your phone, it can be expensive. Okay. Yeah, uh, I think so. Now I've got one of my my I, I can control my whole house on my phone. I so you have Hive. I've got I've got um, like an individual bit of software which it's all networked up. So in your house, when we do it, if you wanted it, you'd have to get a a, a techie specialist in there to to make your house a smart house. So oh every God. every light, everything has got like a, a circuit to your your um, your network right and that would run your whole house so it could be a little bit of a pain in the ass because they're not yeah it sounds it it sounds and it, it could be at least two three four k and it's hassle uh -huh. yeah that's what i was thinking because i i was thinking it's not just something that like oh you say you want to have a smart house and they just give you an ipad no it's like it's very it's all wired up yeah, it's all wired up yeah no i'm it's not really i'm not bothered about that personally. and i think what we need, i think as well obviously if you're going to be away quite a lot i think you need to get a, a good a half decent alarm system in there as well that's, yeah that's i know good. and that's not going to be you know 1500 quid gets you a nice little alarm system and um and if you wanted security cameras in there which is not a lot of money you know that could go to your, your yeah i will um, yeah your phone when if you're in new york you can see you know any, if any disturbance, you've got it there straight away. Uh, last yeah, question is about underfloor heating. So we have underfloor heating on the in the bathroom on uh, on the first floor. Okay. Yeah. So we, I've I've, I've told uh, you know, a few quotes for wet underfloor heating on the ground floor and everywhere underfloor heating on the everywhere others. on the ground floor. Is that yeah, all? So what is this? What is wet underfloor? What's the difference uh -huh. between wet and dry? Okay. So wet dry, is but... run from the boiler with pipes. <laughs> right. But, so we you run little uh, uh, pipe work under the under the flooring, and then your uh, uh, wooden flooring goes on top. Yeah, and it's uh, cheap. Electric is matting. Mm -hmm. uh, electric matting. It's a little bit more money to run because it's electric. Mm. Um, uh, that, but you can use the electric on the uppers upstairs. And the, uh, the only benefits to have underfloor heating for you, it frees up wall space. Mm -hmm. That is it. Yeah. The, cost, yeah. the cost is more. Um, obviously, you don't see radiators, uh, and it just f makes more uh, space on the walls to put yeah. furniture against the walls and so on. Mm. Like if you were, yeah. in your place, if, you, if you're if you're gonna be be putting the money into like coffered lighting things would look a little bit nicer you know don't forget now you know if we're not